Hi, it's Jay here and welcome to another video. So, in this lesson, we're going to carry on with the second special move. And um, just a word of note, in the last video, I missed off a closed bracket here. There were two, it should have been three. I um, didn't notice it until I'd stopped recording. That was due to the IntelliSense not working. Once I got it working, obviously, all the red errors showed up. So, that's just a quick note. I'm sure most of you probably already caught that anyway. But, I think we'll begin. And, I'll just grab my controller here. Uh, we'll begin with testing out what we've done so far. So, let's just go Round one. through. And let's back off. Now you can see how the player moves forward. But if you notice now we cannot move. I'm pressing left and right and we're stuck. Now this isn't a problem if I just stop that there. And that is because we need to revise this function, the wait for special move animation function. Um, already have that planned out, not a problem. But I think first we'll get the code in place for when the player is on the other side of the screen. So we'll begin in special move 2. We're going to skip this first if statement and everything inside this one where player is less than opponent position we are going to copy and let's paste that in below. So we just need to go through and swap out the pluses and minuses for the opposite. So we'll change that to minus 5 is greater than or equal to the 10th move position. So let's just keep having a look. Here, we'll change it to less than. Here, we'll change it to less than. Sorry, that was already less than, I think, yeah. So we'll change that to greater than and let's just now have a quick look. Let's save that off. We'll downsize and we'll run through again. So I just really want to get the testing out of the way in this video and then I can do all the wait for special one for overhaul in Round the one. next one. Fine. So we know it's working on this side of the screen, let's just come, we'll move to the opposite side and we shall see what happens. And there you can see we now move towards the opponent with kick animation. So unfortunately it's got the same issue. If you actually look here, as you can see, 
it is registering the actual movement of the analog stick but the player isn't moving so with that code all in place wait for special move animations now this is the function we need to overhaul but we're going to do that in the next video because I want to get it all done in one video but for this video let's come to the special move black robots special move movement and just having a look I'm going to comment out the opponent's position and just check so we just have that one error so let's just get rid of that code so let's have a look and I'm just going to have a look at the naming conventions we used here And we'll change any that needs to be changed. So S2 audio source. I'm going to change this to BR SP2. Just going to change the naming convention for the audio clip also I'll just copy the audio source I'll change it in the inspect there as well that's it I was pretty sure we didn't use it anywhere else. Let's change that one now to BRSP Audio. And I'll change that also in the comment. And this is just a case of tidying up the code. For now, let's save that off. Obviously, we're going to need to change some of this. So let's swap out that debug log. Should have done that in the previous lesson. So let's have a look. Energy ball explosion. Let's change this to special <coughs> move and I'm going to call it strike explosion. Let's just break this up for commenting. And let's swap out the naming convention there. And we'll save that off. So we've just done a little bit of tidying up the code in this video. And obviously we've tested it out as far as we've done so in the next video we'll overhaul the wave special animations function 
and that will allow the player to keep moving once the second special move has completed so um pretty simple pretty short video for today but uh, i thought it was good to get all these bits out of the way in one video and then we can just concentrate on the function in the next um but i hope you enjoyed it anyway as always i hope to see you next time and until then bye for now